in this blender tutorial we will try to model this object and here you can see it is a cylindrical part so we should start with the cylinder not the cube I'm going to delete this object and then I'm going to add a cylinder so here is the cylinder and I will go with the 24 words then I'm going to rotate the cylinder into 90 degree then apply the rotation I'm going to scale it along the x-axis like this apply the scale then go to the edit mode turn on the x-ray mode select these faces and use the insert operation like this and then right click breach faces in this way then you need to select these faces you can see don't select these faces then E to extrude it and move it along the Z axis then S and Z and give the value 0 to scale it along the Z axis then extrude it along the Z axis one more time then you need to select this edge snap your 3D cursor to it and then select these faces and change the transform pivot point to 3D cursor then S, Y and 0 so you can properly align it then change the transform pivot point to bounding box or individual origin then select this face and E to extrude it and move it along the Y axis then select this edge and Ctrl X to dissolve it then select this edge loops with a shift select in this way make sure you should apply the scale then select these edges also and Ctrl B add a bevel in this way then select this edge loop and Ctrl B add bevel on it shape factor should be 0.5 and increase the bevel segment and give the proper bevel width so you can get this kind of curve then dissolve these edges and select everything mesh symmetry so take the symmetry along the x axis and y axis and then just create new topology add there you need to use the knife tool to create this topology then use the knife tool and create cut at here in this way and add one loop cut here like this you can add one loop cut at here and then you can select these words and moist them at the center in this way and then you can dissolve these edges then select everything mesh and symmetrize take the symmetry along the x axis and you can dissolve these edges like this and then you can hit the control 2 to add the sub D modifier and check your model and it is looking really well share smooth it then select this edge loop then scale it then add one more loop cut at here then select this face loop use the insert operation press alt s to scale it along the normal then use the insert operation and press alt s to scale it along the normal then you can select these edge loops and then Control b add bevel on them add two segment bevel and shape factor should be 1 and give the proper bevel width then select this edge loop and Control b add bevel on it then select everything mesh symmetrize take the symmetry and there you go in this way you can create this kind of design you can see here I'll keep the bevel width more so I'm getting smooth form and here I have keep less bevel width so I'm getting the sharper details at there so it's totally up to you and in this way with the help of cylinder you can create this kind of design so that's it for today thanks for watching if you like this tutorial then hit that like button and subscribe to the channel bye bye see you next video take care